Good morning, class. My name is Ellen Manchester. I will be your uh, Math 1324 050, the internet um, instructor for Flex 2 in spring of 2024. So I just like to do an introductory um, video for you so that you can see I'm a real life person and that I, um, I do want to help you and I do want to answer your questions. Um, I want to walk you through um, some of the things to look for in your class. Since this is an internet class, there's no uh, meetings that you need to come to. You will just be working through the process of the class. So let me share my screen and I'm going to kind of introduce you to our classroom. Okay, so here is your Flex 2 1324 uh, 050 class. Um, this is a, an eight week course. Um, it starts March 18th. And so um, what we do is we take a 16 week course and we cram it all into eight weeks. So this is a very fast moving course. There's no time to procrastinate. There's no time to breathe. You just have to be in and be all in um, throughout the entire eight weeks. Don't ever take your foot off the gas um, in this class because you will get behind. And I do not accept late work. So this is not to be mean, this is to prepare you for the business world. When your boss gives you a deadline, the deadline is, um, is uh, set in stone. So you need to make sure that you are aware that any of the, de any of the due dates are set. There's no extensions. Um, if there is a dire emergency, um, we can talk but I rarely move those due dates because it's open for you. The entire semester is open. Um, you should be working ahead of schedule just in case life throws you a curveball, um, but you are aware of what is due. You have a whole week to get it done. And so if you wait till Monday at nine o'clock and then your internet goes out, that's on you. So again, not to be mean, I just know what it takes to, to be successful in this class and you have to stay on track. Um, getting behind is not an option. So this is our opening Canvas page. This is where you will live the entire semester, um, the entire eight weeks. This is where you go to get any of your information. Um, all of my um, communication will be via either announcements or email. So your announcements are going to be super important. If it's something from me, that means I have something I need to communicate to you. So the best way to do that is get Canvas on your phone. There's an app and then all the announcements and emails come directly to your phone. So you don't miss any, any important information. Um, so you will start in this class. This is, again, I said an eight week um, course. It starts March um, 18th. And here is my contact information. So uh, my office, uh, my face-to-face -face office is on the um, Northwest Vista campus. I'm in Juniper Hall 111-0. And then I also do a Zoom office hours. So my Monday, Wednesday office hours are face-to-face -face in my office on Northwest Vista campus. My Zoom is on Tuesday, Thursday. And then um, here's all my, my hours here. And this is, this is in several places um, throughout the, the orientation module, okay? Um, here is how you get into my Zoom room. You just click on this and it'll open a, up a Zoom room for you. Um, so uh, it's pretty it's pretty clear how to get to it. Um, if you have questions, I will respond to my phone. Everything comes to my phone. I'll respond as quickly as I can because I know you're probably working on your homework while you're um, emailing me. Um, I don't check my phone after nine o'clock at night. So make sure if you have questions that you you send it to me well before nine so that I can get back to you. Otherwise, I will I will respond early the next morning. So the way that this class works is um, the first thing you're going to do is you're going to go here to Alamo Books to get signed up for my math lab. So if I open it, it's going to look different than what what you're going to see. But um, you will start with Alamo Books and then you will open um, make sure it says 1324.050, you'll launch the courseware. And then because you have to sign up, I'm already signed in. So because you have to sign up, you'll open this open my lab and mastering, and then it'll walk you through the process. And then I have written out pro um, uh, instructions in the, in the uh, module, in the orientation module. Okay, but that's the first step that you're going to do. And in the modules, 
this is where you just follow the module step by step. You do have to go through every page. You have to click through each page. Otherwise, you can't get to the next one. But I wanted to show you here's our orientation um, overview. Um, this orientation, you have to have it completed by Wednesday, March 20th. Otherwise, I will drop you. Um, again, not to be mean, I'm just telling you, you cannot get behind. You have to stay on schedule. Um, so this is our, our uh, Flex 2 schedule. You can, um, this is a, a Word document or a PDF. You can print it yourself if you want, or here's the schedule. And so you can see your first um, due date is March 20th. And over here on the left is what is due. And then the next due date is March 25th. So it just keeps right on going. So even though maybe you finished your orientation, just jump right into module one. Don't wait, just jump right in. Okay, so this is our eight weeks. Um, we do have a holiday on Monday, April 1st. That's a new holiday, Cesar Chavez holiday. Um, so your due date will be Tuesday. April 2nd, but other than that, everything is due on Monday. So you have, you know when it's due, that doesn't mean you do it on Monday. If you notice, there are several assignments in every week. So you have to stay on track. You should be working in your in your My Math Lab every single day, even if it's 10 to 15 minutes, you should be working in it every single day. If you wait until the last, even Sunday or Monday to do your homework, you're gonna get behind. Um, this takes a while. It, it definitely will be, you know, anywhere between 10 and 20 hours a week that you will need to invest. Some weeks, the homework takes longer than others. So don't wait to the last minute. I cannot um, stress that enough. Um, our finals week is um, May 6th through the 10th. So there is one test that you have to take face to face, and that's our final. So within the first week or so of class, you will be signing up on Sign Up Genius to um, get a spot to take your final. You can pick which day and which time. Um, there's a couple times um, on some days and then one time on other days, but you have Monday through Friday to choose which date and time that you wanna um, sign up for. If you need to change it, that's fine, but we just wanna make sure that you understand in this class, you have one proctored face-to-face -face final. OK, and it's the final exam. So you will be doing that um, as soon as uh, within the first module, you'll be signing up to um, get your your final signed up. OK, so the way the modules work. Is you're going to open up the module. Here's your here's all the information that you need. If you um, want tutoring or you need a calculator, you do need a calculator for this class. You cannot use your phone, so you have to have a calculator if you don't own one. You can borrow one um, on the NVC campus, and there's your information. Um, if you have an old laptop that doesn't work very well, you, there's also a loan, a laptop loan um, process. So no excuses. You have to if you're, you've you've signed up for an online class, you have to have a computer, you have to have internet, and you have to have a calculator. Okay. So office hours. There's the link again. Um, anything that is indented in your module, those are assignments, okay? So you're going to do a discussion, you're going to do the orientation quiz, you're going to do the My Math Lab orientation, and then here's where you sign up for your proctored exam, okay? So four things due March 20th, and then you immediately move right into module one, okay? Now, the resources, when you click on resources, there's videos. Some of the videos I created, some of them are ones that I like that I've found on the internet. So um, go through the videos. If you understand a concept already, you don't, you know, it's not necessary, but it's helpful. And then you can just click next after the resources. And now you're in your My Math Lab. Pearson is the uh, publisher of My Math Lab. So you're just going to open Pearson. And once you open it, it takes you right to My Math Lab. So you don't have to go in and out of Canvas. Everything is done in Canvas. So here's all your My Math Lab questions, and you're good to go. OK, so that's how the module works. Anything indented, again, anything indented in the module is an assignment. So homework one, homework two, homework three, homework four, and quiz two. So there's a lot going on in module one. These are due. March 25th. 
So we start on the 18th. That's in one week. You have quite a few assignments to do. Be, again, because we took all of the 16 weeks material and, and put it into an eight week process um, or semester. So don't stop. Just keep right on going. Everything is open. You can you can get started. OK, the other thing that you're going to need for this class is when you take a test, you are going to submit your work. So you will do the test. It's a my math lab test, but you will write things down. You will write down the process on paper. Then you will scan it. I use something called an app called Cam Scanner. There's a free version. It works great. That's for Android. If you have an iPhone, they have um, the the notes, the I, iPhone notes or Apple notes, I think it's called. Um, and in the notes, there's a camera that is a scanner and it turns it into a PDF. So, so in order for Canvas to accept a document, it has to be a PDF. So you have to save it as a PDF. Cam scanner, it automatically um, saves it as a PDF and then the iPhone notes automatically saves it as a PDF. So you'll just submit your work um, and then that's what I use to grade your test because I see I want to see your process. So if you aren't sure whether to write it down, write it down. I want to see uh, your, your, the whole process that you go through. And we'll talk more about that as the, as the semester goes on. Um, so you will be turning in your work. If you do not turn in your work for a test, that's 50% off the grade. So if you got an 80% on your test and you did not turn your work in, it automatically drops it to a 40%. Okay, so I want to see your work. That's super important. Okay, um, the way that the grades um, are broken down in this class is tests are 50% of the grade. So it it you have to be prepared in order to take the test. Um, if you can't pass the test, you cannot pass this class. So again, tests are worth 50% of the grade. So again, this is our, um, our uh, syllabus. It gives you all, that's our con my contract to you. So here's the grade breakdown. Tests are 50%. Your homework is 15%. The quizzes are 10%. The discussions are 5%. And the final exam is 20%. So notice between the tests and the final exam, that's 70% of your grade. So tests are super important. If you miss a test, you we should just drop you because you can't recover from a missed test. So make sure that you take your tests, that you uh, do what's required to be prepared. With math, I say math is an action. You have to do the work. Just reading or just watching videos is not enough. You have to actually walk through the process, writing things down, um, calculating, doing all the action that's required in, in um, the process. Okay, so that's it for now. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask and I will uh, enjoy watching you guys succeed.